This is the search, the, the church of Santa Trinita. Quite impressive. They love the scooters in Florence. Actually, they do in most of Italy. I don't know why we don't see far more of them in England. Fantastic way to get around a city. This is Piazza Santa Maria Novella. We got our building there. That's right the focal point. But this garden's are quite pleasant. It'd be nice if they had the fountain on. Quite impressive. So it's less than this one, a bit clear. This is a Gallery Academic Academica. Like 15 euros to get in, and a lot of beautiful paintings. They're in a painting older than say 500 years. Most of them were done in the 14, 1500s. Older than most countries. Instruments of like 14th, 15th, 16th century. It's quite impressive. Isn't it? These are Michelangelo's work, some finished, some abandoned. But when you go down, and that's the original one he did. How oh, goddamn cool is that? Side of the statue, you don't know, we see. Back side. It's quite a queue. I don't know how long it takes to go down. Moving slowly, but potentially a good. 20 minutes, half an hour or so. After queuing for about 45 minutes. Finally got in. Some spurs and the grave in 1351. Some of these are the original Roman walls dating back to the 9th century. Some of the early foundations. Oh, as you can imagine, a lot of things in those days were built on and built on and built on. It's more money or they got grander or whatever. You can see some of the original flooring. It's an impressive building.
but your church inside is quite boring to be honest. <laughs> but the building is beautiful. Oh, oh there it is. It's a couple of hundred years to build it or to complete it, as you can imagine. Really, really busy now. When in Florence, you got to have a gelato. It was supposedly invented here. Cream and chocolate, and it's really nice. in the bit lots of vecchio it's quite dark in here I don't know if it's picking it up it's a beautiful building see how busy it is on a, I don't know what day it is to be honest This is the Piazza di Signoria. Oh, we just murdered the language, but all the beautiful statues. And David, this is where the original one stood until 1910. And it was a move, move to the one we saw earlier to protect it from the elements. And that was put in its place. I've just heard a little boy. <laughs> Why is his head next to that man's willy? <laughs> Pretty medieval building. Well, probably new, but medieval houses had them to generally protect the doorway from literally from shit because there's buckets and you just throw it out the window. Wine by now. ticket I couldn't buy one for the tower and then I woke it past and I saw it open again so first like they made me buy an extra ticket but then I just what do I think it's 414 steps to get here and they've obviously got to go back down but the views are pretty spectacular Worth the climb? Yes. We're paying double. Yes. It's quite a small ledge. But luckily it's, it's enclosed. So I can't 
see how high I'm going. So I didn't get as scared. Ça fait quasiment 10, 10 fois notre, notre Impressive voilà. views, eh? I think it's probably a good view because it's sun. But that's what you can climb up to the top of the dome. If you want to do that, book in advance. It's Thursday and it's booked up until at least Sunday, every single time slot. So plan ahead. Do the opposite to what I do, really. Now we're there on the way down. Probably about three hours queuing to various things today. Crazy. This step seems to go on forever. Another level. Look at this. About three or four of these. You can have a little breather. Impressive views. <laughs> 